Hey everybody, and welcome back to Terra Tech with me, Tenzin. Thanks for tuning back in. Um, we're just gonna go over something really quick here. I hope there's some new improvements. I hooked up everything I was talking about in the last episode. Um, so hopefully the audio is coming out a little bit better. You know, we'll, we'll, we'll see. Um, as for that, um, I'm, we're going to go over the conveyor belt system because I noticed that we forgot, or I forgot, to go over it with you guys last time, even though I was mad about it. Um, but here's our new tank that I built really quickly because we're going to be hunting down the GSO guys pretty much all for the next couple episodes. I am going to be cutting back the episodes from half an hour to 20 minutes. Um, also, there won't be cutscenes. So, like, I noticed that I did do a heavy, a lot of editing in a couple of them. But, uh, I think until, I'll, you know, I start getting feedback from you guys, I'm just going to keep running them as full length. So I'll do 20 minutes, 20 minutes, you know, just the full gameplay. So you guys can actually see what happens and for the most part. Anyways, other than building bases and vehicles, right? But I'll take you through the vehicle right now, or our base right now. So... We, sh uh, we set up this last time and Then I said I was gonna do everything else by myself. So set up some batteries or, or shield bubbles around the uh, edge of the base There is some wireless charging going on But then I have all these auto turrets, which I'm not a hundred percent sure if they're actually working or not because I had a guy actually enter the base and They didn't really do anything um, I don't know why. Like, this one fired at him, but this one didn't do anything. So maybe I just had him set up wrong. I don't know, I had him on set on follow, so... Maybe that's... When they're on follow, they don't attack. I don't know. But yeah, the tower's... Pretty much how it is. Um, it's not bad. I like the base at the moment. Um, it's gonna give us somewhere to fight out of. We will. I was gonna go with a wall all the way around, but I think the towers will be, or these rotating towers at the moment, will be good. Um, yeah, the batteries, solar panels, guns on every tower. Don't know if we can click over. Yeah, we can. But, um, yeah, okay. Oh, actually, you know what? I should move this one over here now. Just so everybody knows, or just so you guys know, how I have the shield bubble set around the perimeter here. If they attack the base, their guns will actually shoot up here towards this tower, these towers, and try and knock them down. So, it is what it is. We will fix it eventually, but at the moment I'm not too... Actually, can we do... Because we have to put a repair bubble on here anyways. Surprised I didn't do that. Uh, put the big... GEO one right in, oh, that's the battery. I'll just plop that one there. Yeah, see, you can see the damage that, it was mostly the tower. These three, I think they were just blocks that we picked up. So we're gonna move out today, and I'm just not gonna hold back on it. Oh, I'll lift this guy up really quickly. So we got the Adventure uh, Zoomer tires on. Uh, adventure frame, batteries down the center, cannons on the front, rifle or whatever you want. Yeah, the rifles. And then we got the Uzis. And what I wanted to do is get this thing to actually sit in between these batteries where we have our, but apparently it's too thick, where we have our shield bubbles and stuff like that. Ah, sorry. Almost forgot again. The conveyor belt. So this is the special one here, the GSO down, can, oh no that's not it, here it is, GSO filter conveyor belt. So we'll just throw this somewhere, see how it says any on it, here we'll just zoom over, so it says any on it, so you right click on it and then you can put none, any, resources, raw resource, refined resource or alloy, and that's the only thing that it'll transport. So you can choose, you know, refined resource, any refined. So that, it's just a way to like filter, I guess, from your refineries to whether or not you want it to go to 
like the foundry or the fabricator, you know, like. Okay, we got that out of the way. Now, let's get going. Um, wow, I didn't think. Like, this is our base used to be just over that hill. It's just over that hill. And this place is, like, littered with guys now. Um, we have to kill GSO. We've got... Oh, yeah, we're... Oh, pushed the wrong button right off of that. <coughs> now, normally, like, we took... We got rid of the three-pound cannons because... We just... I don't know. I just thought they were, you know, they were no good. And, like, they are, they're good. But they were just... I thought they were destroying too many blocks at once. But now it's like, you know what? We got so many blocks, we don't need to pick up everything we find. And this guy's gonna die. There you go. Mm, uh oh. Was that a repair bubble? I know we can afford to buy them, but... And, um, there has not been an update this week, so... Just so everybody knows. Um, I hope actually everybody's doing good. I'm doing pretty good today. Uh, I kind of want to... Um, when we get this... I'm excited for when we have this all completely done. The, the campaign and stuff like that. Because I'm really excited to start getting into like giant builds and stuff like that. When I... After we finish the campaign until we start adding more stuff, I think we'll, that's what we'll do. It's just giant builds, and <clears throat> we'll see how long those episodes are. I might those might be like montage videos, and plus we might actually even build something like super super fast or a flyer, and just fly in one direction for twenty minutes. I did notice though. Um, I don't know if you guys remember. How I was talking about how I flew off uh, in one direction for quite a while one that one day. Anyways, long story short, um, the this map. Remember how actually it happened in one of the episodes where it kind of like got glitchy and started. Yeah, well, glitchy, right? Well, I'm pretty sure it's because we were actually further than w what the game is used to, so it was rendering the format or the environment as we were moving so that's why it seemed all glitchy and stuff like that and we were getting lifted up so there must have been something underneath us or there is something underneath us yeah <clears throat> okay so we've got hostiles is this way are they all that way mm, pretty much okay this point of interest we've been to it a couple of times it's just nothing ever shows up there so i don't know if it's glitch or not um, you're dead. Shouldn't have messed with me. Oh, come on. I will admit, this tank's probably one of our better ones. I did build it, and it was a little bit longer. But I noticed that, uh, when we were going down into dips and, like, valleys and stuff like that, it gets stuck. So... We actually had to change it. And I, I like how it is now. It's shorter, a little bit wider. But, you know, we're one. No. We're very well protected. I'm having, like, uh. This game has actually turned me into a really bad hoarder. It's like, as soon as you see those blocks on the ground, it's like, oh, I have to have them. Like, look at this. Like, see, this is, uh, right there in the sun is where we started. So we're going to destroy all these guys because we need the experience. Come on. I got to move on to your brothers and sisters. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're just going to drive over all those parts. Wow. I didn't think the tower was... What the hell? There was a backup so we can take one on one.
back up. Get out of my bubble. This is my space. Um, somebody behind us now? Oops. No. Seems to be leaving us alone. We're taking out this tower, though. Uh, I think we got more firepower than him. Maybe not. We'll see. We're just going to watch the batteries here. I just don't want to do too much maneuvering around. Okay. Hmm. I don't know about this. I honestly don't know. Usually their batteries don't last that long. Wow. It's almost like he was getting repaired as he was... Okay, well, I'll move on. Mm -hmm. Just looking to see if any of those guys were... Venture. Because we still need more Venture. Venture stuff, so... And yes, we should probably stop and repair, but... I don't feel like it. Or, sorry, not repair. Ah! Solar panels. Oh, did I lose a wheel? Oh, we did. Hmm. Boom. Okay. Catwalk. Okay. So Dirt Spike is the hostile, okay. Oh, gonna kill Dirt Spike's friend here. Yep. These Uzis are nice, but I... The very first, like the other tank that I was telling you guys about at the very beginning, we had it, or we built it, and... I'm just gonna drop this real quick. Um, we built it really quickly. And I filled it with uh, Uzis, but the problem is, is that they, um, they're not very accurate. They're just all over the place, so we couldn't like single fire, single fire anything. Yeah, see how many of those four blocks we have now? It's because I went a little nuts, thinking, okay, well, we're gonna build a wall all the way around our base and. Really, we ended up not doing that at all. And probably for the best, just because of how it was set up. Because if uh, they would have taken out just one or two little spots, it would have knocked the whole thing down, so. I'm sorry for all this charging. I know that this episode's pretty light on it so far, but I know on the previous ones we've done quite a bit, and it's like, oh man. <laughs> But I'm trying to do better than that as we get better because I know uh, the venture has some better stuff coming not uh, as in blocks and framing and stuff like that so when we get those it'll be easier for us to carry more batteries which thus should make it easier for us not or should make it so we don't have to charge as often because then I can put more batteries on it you know that there. Corner, we've got hostiles. No. It's kind of gotten a little bit glitchy, you guys. I'm not 100% sure why, but it's not horrible either. I don't know if you guys are catching that either. Well, you wouldn't know the difference uh, for the lag, but yeah, there is a touch of lag. That's why I'll just run into stuff every once in a while. Really? Clowny V1? <laughs> oh, Clowny V1, you, you are dead. Uh, I'm gonna carry that armor piece, just because we can. Okay, so then there's GEO. Holy cow. I guess we should have... Uh, we'll go to this point of interest, and... As we head that way, we'll kill as many... GSO guys as we can because GSO is what we want 
and Venture. I don't think they... I didn't see any updates. So I don't think they upgraded the... We should almost... Should have put more cannons on this. Not 100% sure. Oh, Storms! Just die. There we go. I think we lost the wheel again. Nope. So he lost the wheel. Interesting. Because it really looks like one of ours, not his. Oh, he had a couple of them on. Okay. Uh, does he have a three pound cannon? He does. Because it'd be nice to put something right here, these two spots. But I guess we could have put lasers or... Could have, should have, didn't. And that's typical us, but hey, I remember the radar. So that's gotta be, oh, but we don't have any lights. It's gonna be a dark night. <laughs> what touch down there? You notice we're getting a lot of GSO crashing down around us. It's, I don't know how to explain it. Some of these guys make a, a real pain in the butt to try and... What's that? What is his name? Can't kill... Oh, What's his name? Nah, no, it's like can't kill something. I saw one of the lasers that we wanted to put on the front, or we're thinking about putting on the front. Yeah, but I destroyed it. It's a bad man. Oh, no, there it is, I think. Oh, no, wrong one. Survey the wreckage a little bit. No. Alright, moving on at point of interest. So, even though the episodes are going to be shorter from now from now on, I hope that that's alright with you guys. If not, just let me know if you want me to go back to 30 minutes. Um, I just think 20 minutes of gameplay per videos, you know, it's alright. I didn't mind doing 30, it's just, oops, strictly up to you guys. So just let me know, and I will adjust accordingly. Ah, here's some venture. You can tell by that window. Venture truck. Oh, your toes. You got two uh, gas tanks. <laughs> Not even take two seconds. What is this? Uh, one of their machine guns. Venture pod racer. Venture Pod Racer can't take a hit. What's this one? Venture Pod Racer 2. Oh, you're yeah, toast too. Boom. Oh, this is that. Um, this is a new piece of tech, you guys. That is a gyro stabilizer. So I guess, like, with the. Um, oh, with airplanes and stuff like that, I guess it'll help us. Oh, look at this. As long as we have one of these up open somewhere in the world, I guess we can uh, modify our stuff whenever possible, or whenever we feel like it, which we're going to do right now. Mm. Yeah, I don't mind anything else. Okay. Oops. Back to hunting. Hopefully we can make it to this point of interest. Um, yeah, right here, and we are here, hmm, 
Um, okay, well, I'm going to end the episode here. We'll continue from here in the next episode, and uh, we'll keep hunting. So if you liked, uh, like the episode, please comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the episode. I can't talk. Next episode. <laughs>